And uh, oh my goodness, <laughs> look at this lovely audience. I hope I'm not overdressed. <laughs> I can see I am. <laughs> Hello, Parsons. How are you this afternoon? Oh, wonderful. What, a, what an enthusiastic group. I know that this show has been longer than Les Miserables <laughs> and had fewer laughs. <laughs> well, I'm delighted to be here amongst all these lovely ladies and gentlemen, some of whom are very elderly. I mean, this, this lovely gentleman sitting right here. No, you, darling, look up at me. Don't look at me when I'm talking to you. <laughs> oh, this poor man has no idea where he is. He has no... He thinks he's at home watching Shrek. <laughs> he's just here for the colour and movement, aren't you, darling? <laughs> Look at his eyes, sparkle. Oh, darling, you're lovely in your own spooky way. And, of course, we've got all of these delightful ladies out here. Oh, these lovely ladies, like this woman right on the front row. Hello, darling. What is your name? You! Barbara, hello, Barbara. It's lovely to see you. <laughs> oh, I love that dress. It's, it's certainly an old favorite for you, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> and this lovely woman, I adore that fabric. Lucky for you, there was so much of it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm teasing her, I'm teasing her. Please, I don't pick on people. I empower them. <laughs> Think about it that way, darlings. I, now, I must tell you, these lovely ladies sitting out here, we're, we're all of a certain age. Apparently you are, Barbara. <laughs> we have our drives and juices, don't we, darling? Well, you see, I, before I stepped on stage, I was visiting my gynecologist, Dr. Julio Iglesias Sr. <laughs> yes, he's the father of uh, uh, Julio Iglesias Jr. and the grandfather of Enrique Iglesias. His, he's 87 years old. His hand shakes a little, but that's really not a drawback in his line of work. <laughs> My goodness. Anyway, today when I was in the stirrups, he looked up and said, Edna, why do you give so much? <laughs> He's a delightful man. He truly is. As a matter of fact, I don't step on stage until Dr. Iglesias gives me the thumbs up. <laughs> Oh, goodness gracious. Well, as I look at her, we've got, we've got female agents and male agents. Isn't that delightful? It's, it's a beautiful thing. As a matter of fact, this used to be just a man's game, but it's not anymore. As a matter of fact, I feel a song coming on. I'm one of the boys, one of the girls. I throw a low go. Start over, start over, darling. I just totally botched that. You know how that happens. Every now and then, it just goes right out of your head. Let's try it again. Thank you, Steve. I'm one of the girls who's one of the boys, enjoying the jokes and the smokes and the noise. You wanna go fishing? Well, hand me a reel. I majored in poker, so shut up and deal. I'm a one of the does who's one of the stats. I chug a lug bruise when I lose on the nads. Despite the max factor, you'll find on my face, I'm a one of the girls, although I'm one of the boys. One of the girls, who's one of the boys, enjoying the jokes and the smokes and the noise. Despite the max factor, you'll find on my face, for barbershop pours, I'm a fabulous face. One of the queens, who's one of the drones, Hand me the dice and I'll rattle your bones. Despite of the dress, the finesse and the poise, I'm one of the girls, although I'm one of the boys. I'm one of the girls who's one of the boys, enjoying the jokes and the smokes and the noise. If you want to go fishing, well, hand me a reel. I'm majored in poker, so shut up and deal. I'm a one of the gals who's one of the guys. I'm him with the sand, you'll brattle your eyes. In spite of the lacquer, the lady enjoys. I'm a one of the girls, although I'm one of the boys. My God, I think I'm having a senior moment today. This is better with the chorus, and unfortunately, I can't afford one. I'm one of the days 
one of the nights. My Friday night treat is a seat for the fights. You wanna go stroke with the varsity crew. You wanna play snooker, well, chalk up your cue. I'm one of the does who's one of the stags. I chug a luck bruise when I lose on the nags. I have layers of lacquer a lady enjoys. I have earrings and bracelets and various toys. But I love when I've slipped into rip corduroys. One of the girls, I am one of the girls, one of the girls who's one of the boys. Ah! Thank you, possums. Oh. oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I don't get an announcement. Ladies and gentlemen, that was Michael Walters as Dame Edna. He's been impersonating the Australian comedy legend for over 20 years. His fully staged show celebrates the comedy and music of the Dame from Down Under. Michael also impersonates Jackie Gleason and recently appeared in the pre-Broadway premiere of The Honeymooners, The Musical. And he knew his lines. He did. Oh, goodness, what a lovely crowd you are. And it is time to bring this show to a close. But before we do, I'm going to need some help from my friends. All right, Maestro, if you would. There's no business like show business, like no business I know. Everything about it is appealing. Everything the traffic will allow. Nowhere could you get that happy feeling. When you are stealing that extra bow There's no people like the costumes that make up scene They're like the audience that lifts you when you're down The headaches, the heartaches, the backaches, the flops The sheriff who escorts you out of town The hoping when your heart beats like a drum The closing of when the customers don't come. Everybody! There's no business like show, business like no business I know. You did work before the show has started. That's your favorite uncle died and gone. Top of that, your my pa have parted. You're broken hearted. But you go on. Dressing room, they hung a star. Let's go. 